again, it's Callum from Termo's Chester, carrying on with my taste test of the new Chieftain range of pipe tobaccos. And today I'm doing the last of the three taste aromatics in the range, and that is the Lazy Day mixture. And damn if I don't love a Lazy Day. Uh, this blend is something else. Um, opening the tin, it's... There's this thing that happens with me with pipe tobacco sometimes. Um, I don't know if you can relate, but when a smell hits you and it just completely sparks all those bits in your brain where you know it's hitting some kind of memory, but you can't quite place it. But it's got this really distinctive, sweet smell. And it. Um, I had this with a few other tobaccos where it just reminds me of sticking my nose in a bag of sweets as a kid. Um, and I can't quite place which sweets, which is really, really bugging me. But it's some kind of like really nice fruity gummy sweet. Um, the blend itself is uh, Virginia, Cavendish and a little bit of Carolina Burley. And casing wise, um, it boasts itself as having uh, vanilla, mango and citrus. Now, I don't particularly get the mango on the smell. As I say, I get that kind of non-specified gummy sweet from somewhere in my memory. But when it comes to actually lighting it, the mango really, really comes out in full force. Uh, the vanilla comes out as a little bit of creaminess, and then you do get this very, very slight tanginess from the citrus, just bringing it all together really, really nicely. Um, it vaguely reminds me of a pudding. My missus does quite a lot of just a bunch of mango and passion fruit in yogurt when she's on a health kick and it's, it's really really nice and it just reminds me of that when I'm smoking it. Uh, the moisture level is really nice as well, burns really really easily from the first light, not had to faff around, um, obviously I've been yammering so this will probably have gone out by the time I finish talking but as far as my general puffing while I was testing it before I started filming, very very easy going with one, one light no touch-ups and no tongue bite as well, which is really, really quite something in a blend that's this aromatic. So again, like a lot of the, uh, the other two uh, cased aromatics in this range, they, I appreciate they've gone for flavour styles that you don't often see in cased aromatics. They've gone a little bit outside the box, which I think is really, really important when you tend to see a lot of the same flavours a lot of the time in pipe tobacco, and they pulled it off, in my opinion, exceptionally well. So if you want to try a uh, aromatic, especially if you're normally into aromatics, but want to try something different, or you just want to dip your toe into this side of tobacco, definitely recommend Lazy Day or any of the other two uh, cased aromatics from Chieftain so far. So next I'll be going on to the stronger, more traditional British English side of aromatics from this range. So I hope you will join me then. If I tempt you with this tobacco, it's available as always at termos.com. If you do try it, hope you like it. Please do let us know what you think. Uh, we always like to hear know what you think, by the way. But especially when it's a newer tobacco, we love getting feedback from people about what they think of it as well. Because that's how feedback works. Um, and obviously, as always, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more in the future. So until next time, thank you for watching and I'll see you soon. Cheers.